All right, and then next we have the beautiful and talented Anna Marie Selby. Thank you. I'm going to introduce <laughs> yourself and yeah. tell them what you do. Can it? Oh, it's oh, there it is. Slide. We're off. You guys Hi. don't don't be shy about the catwalk. Oh too. no, I'm gonna go. Oh, you <laughs> work it. <laughs> work. We the work catwalk, it. Girl. <laughs> no, hi guys. My name is Anna Selby. I am the founder of Pretty Witty, and I am also the director of social media for Mindful Health. Mindful Health, if you don't know, is the Danette May brand. So if you really want under the hood of what we're doing, go to all of Danette May's social channels. You can see all of our work. So. My wicked smart idea, and I thank you guys for this, is we are organically capturing avatars using our social media channels, which all of us are doing, <laughs> and how we're winning is we're actually converting through connection, conversational converse using a bot, and we're converting at a pretty high rate. And I always mess up slides, just so you know. So how we do this is a proprietary process that I refer to as ting tang walla walla bing bang. Can you guys say that with me? Ting, ting tang, tang, walla walla, walla bing, bing bang. bang. Okay, that's a little brand impression for you. I'm gonna break it down. I only have like five minutes. Just know that if you scan this code or this link, I have the details there. Why is this wicked smart? In a matter of one month, and we're able to duplicate this every month, we're able to not only capture the avatars but convert them, there are the results. To dig a little deeper, what are we doing on our social pages? We're actually marketing four completely different products, programs, events, continuity programs at once. And we're not confusing our audience. We're actually converting at a higher rate. I don't know about you, but on an organic social media channel, would you like these results? 46,000 units on just a subscriber. So overall, we've been able to sell in one month and convert 50K in units in excess of 150K in revenue. Again, this is organic, no ad spend. And we have a list dedicated and tailored to 60,000 subscribers. Is that something you guys are interested in? Yeah? Okay, we're gonna dive into this and I'm gonna do it super quick, so hang with me. All right, our avatar. It's really important that you identify our avatar. So our avatars, we use social organic. They're females, 34 to 54. We know that they're behavioral targets using our bots through the Walla Walla. They're lonely. They're seeking weight loss solutions. And this is the stats from December 1 to January 1. These are the four different product points. We did a product pre-launch on something called Cacao Bliss. This is an exclusive product. It's a boutique product with a price point of $79. At the same time, we did a two-week promotion in December. If you guys are familiar with us, we do an awesome 30-day challenge. We ran that with a price point of $47. Now, at the same time, we were still marketing and trying to attract individuals into our continuity program. That's our FitRise membership. We were selling this on annual and monthly, so we were offering both. And then, as if it couldn't be enough, we're getting ready to launch an event in October. We started pre-launching and seeding this event in December using bots. To break it down, we do Ting Tang. Now, Ting Tang is what I refer to as the front-end marketing. It's your post, it's your edge pieces, it is your videos. I kind of separated so you could see what customer journey looks like on a social. For Cacao Bliss, we use edge pieces like recipes, videos, stories. I'm gonna kind of let you guys take a picture of this and go back later. The big thing I want you to focus on is the common CTA that we align with every product on our social platform. The reason we do that is for brand impression. This is a neuromarketing hack, if you will. They're unknowingly seeing that and they know, give me Bliss is Cacao. They know, yes, they're saying yes to our challenge. So on. I gave you a post structure so you have an idea of how to format this. We don't do it any different. How does this look on the front end? If you run down to the bottom, that's what they're seeing is the brand impression of each individual journey. We're attracting them in. This brings us to the Walla Walla. Remember that CTA I shared with you? No? Yes? Yes. Okay. Those CTAs, when that user says that CTA in the comments below, it cues the bot into a dedicated Audit made a journey to that product. So we have attracted that user, they go into the bot, and now you can see the individualized journey points that we use. The biggest thing that I can share with you, personalization in the bot, introduce the product like it was your friend at a dinner table, survey them using behavioral input triggers, and then follow up. Now I know you're gonna ask the tool that we use, it is ChatKit. This is what the conversation looks like, a conversational commerce for each individual journey. 
I know it's kind of small. Just know when we do our journeys, we have what we call input triggers. We input on a variable. What does that mean in conversation? If our intention is to sell the product, we basically reverse engineer that journey and we wait time, wait mood, and the delivered day. The reason we do that is we can wait when that product is gonna convert higher based on what that avatar is sharing with us. All of their journeys, they tailor because we're asking for feedback through the entire process. Now, there are the results again, just to impress upon. If you wanna see it on an individual level, you can go ahead and queue into that, and I have a downloadable. Yeah, grab it, grab it. I think, and I love Anna to death, but she's so freaking smart. Is anybody here like, I totally don't know what she said, but I know I want it, right? <laughs> <laughs> she's a little like that. So I, honestly, the best, thing that I, the best things that I've learned from her have been just subscribing to her bots themselves and see how they, it's not as complicated as it sounds. It sounds quite complicated. But when you're, when you're programming these bots, if you know a little bit about a human nature, if you've written any copy before, it's really not that terribly difficult to do. And, and the solution that she's using makes it very, very simple. So uh, do that and open this channel up for your business because the, the attention rates, the conversion rates, and the, the response rates are ridiculous compared to email. They're probably what? Ten, eight, nine times compared to email? Yeah, so numbers right now is often into our bots from subscribers. So from post in is 96%. Completion of journey means they started the conversation and the bot gave us all the information we need to build their behavioral. 76.6% .6 is the conversion. Yeah, and you get Isn't super. Isn't that just, that's disgusting. It's like sitting down having a talk with somebody, with every one of your clients. So. Well, and it's a little better in the sense that I, I didn't send you an email and I'm hoping you read it. I know yeah. you're reading it. I see you clicking through and now I know where I need to fix my conversation because you dropped off. Yeah, it's, it's really great. Thank you so much, Anna. Yes, I appreciate you. it. All right, so is yeah. Nick up next? I am. This is Nicholas oh, Kuzmich. He doesn't need a clicker. Video crew, if you can just get my... Uh